Right, sheeple, wake up. It's Saturday morning and we got 72 hours till the US presidential election. For sake and defend by the light of the day. For the da -da -da -da. <laughs> Who do you, who do you think's going to win? Everyone is saying that Kamala Harris is going to win by a landslide. She's ahead in all the most important polls in Michigan, in North Carolina, in Nevada, in Wisconsin, in Arizona, and a giant orange balloon, Shitler, go home. Uh, they're saying like, this might, it'd be horrific if Trump wins. Saying, yeah, and Bernie Sanders, he said, if the people of Gaza, if Trump gets in, it's going to be even worse for them. It's like, how much worse can you get than genocide? That's what we've been asking. Who would you vote for? Well, the BBC's done a deep dive. The moment I decided who I'm going to vote for. And the first person is a nurse. You cannot morally vote. You cannot morally vote for Harris. She said that she's left leaning. She's going to vote for Jill Stein. People are saying vote for Jill. Wolfgang Tillmans. <laughs> Who's he? He's a German artist. He said no. Don't vote for Jill Stein. That's been his whole stick. Anyway, Trump, I like Trump's toughness until my family taught me otherwise. So it looks like he's voting for Kamala Harris. So it swings and roundabouts. Um, nothing will sway me away from Trump. Oh. Just like... it's. It, he look, what does he look like? He looks like an Oompa Loompa. He was in a garbage truck. So was, he's a fucking Oompa Loompa, mate. Who would vote for an Oompa Loompa to be the president of the United States of America for the free world? <laughs> oh, fucking hell. What's going to happen if Kamala Harris gets in? Just be more wars, more war in Ukraine. More war in Gaza. It's not even a war, it's a genocide. People saying if Trump gets in, the war stops in Ukraine. The war stops in Gaza. Anyway, why I don't like Trump, but I'll vote for him. Yeah, it's... I don't know. You know... I think Kamala Harris will win easily. I really do. I believe that. America can't be that stupid. But then the worst thing is they ain't even got like, they they don't even care. It's like nobody cares. No one cares about fucking anything. What's in the newspapers? Charles has cut off Andy. <laughs> Uh, Elon Musk, the Prime Minister, is wrong. Did it, who's, what? Elon Musk, front page, what? Look at the little doggy. Look at the little doggy. Fucking hell. Beat the budget. Tax blow for care homes. And have you seen the, like, look at that there, just piles and piles of cars in Valencia, in Spain. Just stop oil. Tor... The Tories have gone ahead. <laughs> Sir Keith Starver. The fucking what? How? What? Trump strategy to challenge US election defeat. Ronnie Ra Ronald Reagan. Yeah, George Bush, Ronald. Winter fuel pensioners now facing drastic cutbacks. There it is, look, just stop oil. They were like shouting at people for like standing in front of cars. Now the climate change has come. Now there's just piles of cars being swept away. <laughs>